What's up, friends of the Good Mood? This is Money, and welcome to a crazy free for all video right here, guys, with the Comijo with Scourge, which, in my opinion, is a real free for all beast. Okay, and in this video, I want to show this to you guys here and prove that this is so and why it is so. Okay, first off, we have the necessary mobility to outrun pretty much anything in the game. Okay, the Comijo is the most mobile bot in the entire game. The Strider can be faster for a short time, but Kamiho will catch up immediately after because he got constant dashing. And if you wait for the right opportunities, you might be able to just sneak some kills left and right, okay? I need to, uh, you know, say as well that it's going exceptionally well right here, okay? Like, every little thing I try absolutely works at this very beginning right here. It doesn't always go this way the whole map, but you will see here, based on the mobility and based on patience, I was able to get all three of these antagonists here out of the uh, out of the match. Now this guy is pretty bad at me. He was looking at me, but I'm just gonna stay here behind the corner. And even if I, I, I went there without a dash, and if I had needed a dash, I would have used it. Because you always have the dash ready with a Camille. That's the thing. It dashes quickly, it dashes far, and has a four second reload on the dash. This is absolute insanity right now. Are we gonna be able to get this guy right here? Let's see. Ah, uh, yep, we did. That's the fourth kill already. I think there's a lot of people who haven't even gotten one kill yet. There's the fifth kill right before he activates the next stealth mode. The match is just 1.5 minutes long and we already gotten five kills because we can be anywhere and everywhere at the same time, man. This is so cool. And that's why I really like about this thing. That's on my own account, by the way. These scourges, uh, all, all you can see here is Mark 1. The Comijo is Mark 1. Uh, the uh, the scourges are Mark One, but uh, it doesn't matter. It's it's good enough. Like Mark Two would only be what is it twenty percent more? You know that's of course twenty percent is twenty percent, but at the same time, it's one out of five. You know it's twenty percent. Okay, so we're still gonna be able to kick some serious butt right here with this thing. I would have almost gotten this bull Ekomiho right there too. The previous one, he went right behind cover at the second he died. If he hadn't gone in cover, I might have probably been able to get that kill as well. Alright, so that would have been the seventh kill in less than two... Well, in a little bit more than two minutes, pretty much, right? Hey, man, this is so insane. And although, yes, I know, this is going ridiculously good. It doesn't work that good all the time. Sometimes at this time, I have maybe two kills, right? Maybe three. But in like it is here, with that many kills... Well, this is something, certainly something crazy. What I'm trying to do here is I'm trying to walk around him so that his stealth, um, no, his lock-on is screwed, right? Uh, that's what I was trying to do, and now you see my luck is passing away. I didn't get the guy before, I didn't get the Haichi himself, I got taken out, and now he got uh, killed by something else too. So now the lucky part is back to normal, I guess. After all, it's only two weapons, it's not three or four like a Spectre has. Um, but it's enough to do some serious harm and maybe get this guy real quick. Let's see, he's looks, he looks pretty damaged already, and there it is. My kill, right? All right, so totally deserved. Yes, 100% my kill. <laughs> this is what Free Fall is, you know, known for. You're basically getting kills that were never meant to be yours, and kills that were meant to be yours totally are just gonna get taken by somebody else. This is the game mode, right? It's all about being sneaky. It's all about coming in at the right time, at the right place, and just taking everything you need. Are we gonna get this? Ah, okay. It could've worked. It could've. Didn't, but it could've, right? So, let's see, we have a uh, Komiho coming out with Tarans. And the Tarans used to be very powerful, but let's not forget that the Scourge never misses and is even super powerful at, you know, short range. I'm dashing around this guy right here so that his physical shield is not blocking me from dealing damage to him, which you see here worked really well. And, um, yeah, so his Tarans also didn't really help, me, help him much. Trying to get this guy out of the way, but his firepower is too high. Four Scourges versus two, well, that's a bit of a problem. Now, let's see, he's gonna probably start... Yep, I knew it was. I knew he would, you know, do his stealth jump. Now, the question is, are we gonna get him before he goes in safety? That is the question. Oh, no, I have a lock-on now. Uh, that's it. And why did I have a lock-on? Let's go back, okay? I purposely have something targeted 
that is in the range, so I can swap target immediately to this vulnerable dude, but he activates his stealth jump, my targeting system ne takes the next best thing, uh, which isn't him, him, because he's still stealth, it's something out of my 800 meters, out of my 600 meters range, ergo, I have to start retargeting completely the 3 seconds, which gives this other Komiho just enough time to steal the kill and drive me off the wall, freaking hell! If this one guy back down there, he didn't know what happened, but he totally screwed me with his stealth jump right there. God damn it. <laughs> but you know, that's normal. It happens all the time, right? And we're just gonna have to live with it somehow. So, here it is. The duel. The duel. We are already lo losing a lot of health, but I'm, I get the feeling that we're gonna be able to kill him really well here because of the constant dashing. And I'm not sure what he's doing. He's somehow getting in if... What the heck was that? He came at me like he wants to, oh, hey, come on, you're brawling it out. And then he gets in firing range and he's like, oh, well, I might as well just, you know, not fire at all. <laughs> what the heck? Uh, but I think what happened there, he knew exactly he wasn't going to hit me very well with his, mo uh, you know, with the touch screen. Uh, the tyrants that need to be precisely aimed at a Komiho that dashes around you, hitting you all the time perfectly with a Scourge. Well, uh, that just shows what the Scourge is, is, is doing for you, right, in this game. So let's see what this down there is and what... What, what are these guys all doing? Everyone is hiding somewhere else now. What is this? Uh, oh, these guys are fighting it out. Okay, let's see. Maybe we can sneak a kill right there. That's what I'm trying to go for. Duh. Are we gonna get some? I think they're... Oh, yeah. Somebody just got taken out. Oh, freaking lock-on came in again. All right, so... All right, we still... His, his stealth ability was just used, so we should be able to do this here. Dash one more time around his Orkin rockets. He did a pretty good job at eluding the target right there. Did a good amount of damage to me, but I got him anyways. Ten kills, still the first. With only this one Kamiho, ladies and gentlemen. And uh, I think this is the only match we're actually going to play, is it? I'm not quite sure, but I think it might be. Getting this kill real quick before, before somebody else got it, and then I die. But you know what? We've got... So many points left. These fifth, fifth points in the upper left corner of the screen. We've got so many of them. And, uh, yo, that shouldn't be a problem. Oh, and by the way, um, if you enjoy this video right here, you find it entertaining, or maybe you even learning something, or, you know, um, if you haven't yet subscribed to the channel, please consider doing that right there, guys, and hit that notification bell, too, so you get notifications for upcoming videos, giveaways, live streams, reviews, whatever, right? Here I was trying to dash around him so he loses his targeting, and it worked. See that? I dashed right around him. He lost his targeting. I kept my targeting because I knew I was going to dash around him. And uh, let's look at, look at this again. Uh, that was a, quite a beautiful moment, right? It doesn't always work, and at first, you see the first dash didn't work. I wanted to dash past him, but he also dashed, and I didn't re realize that fast enough. So I wanted to dash, and I ended up dashing right into him, right? And then the second dash, thankfully, was able to uh, make him lose his lock-on, and, uh, and I get to kill him. If I wasn't able to, you know, dash around him real quick, he would have not lost his lock-on, and he would have killed me very quickly. I wouldn't have had any chance. Are we going to be able to kill him before he goes into stealth mode? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we are. <laughs> 13 kills, and uh, place one here with just this one crazy setup. What is this guy going to have? What is that? What is that? Oh, it's a Spectre. Ooh, are we going to get it? Are we going to get it? Yeah! woohoo! I, You know, it's been a few days since I had this gameplay, and I did not remember if I got him or not. I thought until the very last moment right there, I thought he got me. Um, and then I just I just was so happy when I saw I really got him there. I totally forgot, man. All right, let's go and corner shoot the uh, Scourge um, Scourge Spectre right there. It would work. It wor would work really well. See that? He's not hitting me. I'm hitting him right there. And I would be able to kill him right there. But now he's doing his stealth jump. And, uh, and I messed up my second dash. And now I'm too careful. I kind of want to go behind the cover. But once again, I'm dashing into the wall. And somehow, with a weird, you know, um, delay, he got me. But the problem is, I think he I would have not gotten it because he got killed by somebody else. So you know what? Let's do this again, okay? Let's do the exact same thing again. The same person against the same person. We're gonna do the same thing. He's coming in again with a stealth jump to try not to get hit by any, you know, shots anymore. But of course... This guy has, once again, a free shot at me here, uh, coming in again. See, stealth jump, now he's taking out this uh, Spectre right there, and uh, yeah, that was a, a bad one. And I think now he's even getting me too. Does he? I think he does. I only have one Scourge left. 
This guy just absolutely took everything that you could get from the end of the match. Same as I got everything in the beginning, he just got everything that was at the end. Like, all the things we have done fighting each other there, he just came in and whooped us. Boom. Gotten three kills out of these four possible robots. Now, we have one more... Uh, do we have one more battle coming up? We have a minute left on the clock. And I'm not sure if I'm actually going to fight him. Yeah, I think we do, because the video is not yet over if you look at the, no, okay, the low, mo, mo, down, down, down corner there. So, uh, what is happening? He's just used a stealth jump, so he can't stealth at this very moment. I'm dashing upwards here to do a bit of extra damage to him. And now I want to make him jump. I want to make him do his stealth jump. Uh, but the th problem is he's not he's not a dumb, you know, player. He knows he needs to be careful with the stealth jump. He needs to make it so that he can get me. So I use one dash so he thinks, aha, he just used a dash. And then he expects me to not be able to dash again. Of course, a Komiho can dash all the time pretty much. So uh, his stealth jump was bound to be worthless. It was clear that he would never be able to get me with a stealth jump because I was always going to get behind cover before anything happens. So, here he is, here he is. So, uh, his stealth jump has like 8 seconds left regeneration time, or a cooldown. We are killing him right before that happens, and boom! 15th kill in the last 3 seconds. Match is over right now, boom! Time window just ended. And uh, let's see, 15 kills, place 1. Let's see how much the enemies have, and keep in mind, we're playing in the highest uh, end category of the Champions League. Even though I haven't yet gotten up on these crates there yet, but this is Champions League with more than 5,000 whatever points. And um, we have got outperformed the enemy team. Not only did we get the most kills, we also did the most damage. And all that with just one robot, one beast. The Komiho with Scourge. All right, so uh, I think some of you would probably not guess that this robot could be that good in free for all um, because based on that mobility. The mobility uh, is, is a big factor. You need to always uh, take into consideration, right? When judging a bot. Um, so, um, I'm just gonna say thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like and comment down below. And if you haven't already, hit subscribe as brutal as a man can hit for more. Thanks for bearing with me. You guys are awesome as always. Money Gaming signing off. Bye-bye.